Hello everyone, and welcome back to my Resident Evil 7 playthrough. Where we left off in the previous part is unfortunately missing. It was lost to an unfortunate encoder mishap. Encoder being the thing that compresses the video. Which is done in real time while I'm recording, by the way. I, I don't re-encode stuff before I upload it. Or what some people call re-render. In fact, the last video, if I remember right, was about 18 to 19 minutes of gameplay, and only about four and a half minutes of it was recoverable. And the sad thing is, professional software couldn't do any better than the free open source stuff. So I just went with what the free open source stuff did. Why pay money, you know? But where'd my gun go? I mean, it's not like I had much ammo, but... I would prefer if my gun didn't just randomly disappear. I don't know. I, I don't imagine me as used to walking around with a gun, but I don't think Ethan was either. Oh, let's see. Oh, that's right. There's some nasty stuff out here. One more point. And I have a grand total of two bullets with which to defend myself. These walls kind of fake you out because they're moving a bit. So you're not sure when you're far away looking through this grass, whether or not you're seeing the... Oh, hey. What did the thing that was crawling around over here go? Yes, please open. I keep forgetting if I double click my middle mouse button on the doors, they fly open faster. That's kind of a staple of the Resident Evil games. So much for that. Hmm. That's a carbon copy of down below, I think. I have a feeling they got a little lazy with that. Any supplies in here? Now mouse movement still feels a little wonky. I think I cut that part at the beginning of the last part of the recording. I, uh, oh, I think we found Evelyn again. Won't let me aim at her, though. And I, if I mouse my, my cr crosshair over her, it, it stops aiming in. Anyway, I, at the beginning of my last part, I was trying to figure out why the mouse movement seems so wonky. That's right, I was going to look for mouse smoothing or mouse acceleration or something. I forgot to do it. I cut that out and re-recorded the video and ended up losing most of it. Watch it. What? Why? You need to remember so we can be a family. Why would you want to be a family with crazy people who uh, murdered the rest of your family? She has quite a range of facial expressions for just sitting there blinking, doesn't she? I have a feeling they were trying to make her look a little bit more alive. And they just went a little overboard. Oh, that's lovely. Is this thing going to play like this? It's all gooped up. Oh, that's right. We can't move while this is happening. We've got to sit here staring at a test pattern for a while. Be kind, please rewind. That's close. Wasn't that Blockbuster's old uh, slogan? Alan, you're getting worse. She must have infected me during the attack. And I'm too far gone anyway. But it serves me right. It's my fault she got out. Yeah. It is your fault, but that doesn't mean I'm going to let you die. She didn't attack you? It's part of her imprinting protocol. I can't believe this is happening. Here, take it. It has her tissue samples. 
We find her. You fix this. Okay, Evie. Where are you? Oh, I think we have control now. So, I take it we're playing as some new character that we haven't seen before. Oh boy, this probably explains everything. What kind of ammo was that? <laughs> Machine gun ammo. That's, that's what you're going to call it? Maximum standard. That looks like pistol ammo. So, submachine gun? So basically... It would be pistol ammo. We've probably got a submachine gun. So it's a box of 40. It's 185 grain or 135 grain? That is 135 grain. So probably 9mm then. I, I think that's... I can't actually remember if 135 grain is a fairly standard size for 9mm, but it's close to one. I, I think there's like 120 some odd grain that's fairly standard. So this is probably a 9mm. Yeah. yeah, this looks like a common 9mm. Or like it's based on a common 9mm. Anything in the box? Okay. Got another TV. Somebody's been scratching it up. Some people have no respect. At least it's not a LCD panel. You do not want to scratch those. We appear to be on a boat. She's close. Oh, target acquired. Yes, yes, I figured that out on my own game. Thank you. All right, well, she's very close. Is she on this floor? No, she's not. But that doesn't mean we don't search the rest of the floor for usable stuff. How much inventory do we have? Reasonably full. <laughs> Gotta love guns. You know, that's actually a good idea. If, if I were to design a video game, I would probably want to throw various gun magazines around the, the game just, you know, for fun and aesthetics. What is this? Is this a uh, key? Is this a, a wall safe? That's kind of what it looks like. I mean, it's a terrible wall safe, but... It's a door. It's have the same boring gun magazine all over the place. And technically it's a hunting magazine, not a gun magazine. See, I'm not a hunter. I... I've never been hunting. I have shot at rabbits. I've killed a few rabbits, but only because they were pests and were destroying things. If they weren't destroying stuff, I would have been happy to leave them alone. Oh, more ammo. Do we have a full mag? Can we please pull the gun out? Thank you. 64 rounds. I guess that's a full mag. Okay, that's one way in and out of the kitchen. More supplements. Oh, wait. Pick it up, please. How do we pick this up? There we go. Ew. Oh, is this where Evelyn is? Nice, more ammo. I do find it funny that everybody in this game has a camera strapped to their heads. I mean, we're not seeing the the annoying scan lines or whatever from the cameras that we saw in previous sequences, but still. Mia is watching this on VHS. She's got a camcorder on her head, right? I'm not going in the kitchen yet. Need to search around more. Locked from the other side. We're going to have a ton of that, aren't we? This game is longer than I expected. I'm going to put these supplements away. I have thus far not used them once. 
Okay, let me see what I can make with supplements. Can I make anything with them? Yes, I can. Psycho stim stimulants. Okay. I'd rather make health with them. I'm not getting enough chem fluid to bother making this extra stuff. So store it all. Stop it. Move this up here. All right. Um, what is this? Oh, Evelyn's tissue samples. Well, I guess that's pretty much everything except the elevator, right? I don't know, maybe I should go ahead and take a look in the elevator. But obviously we need to go this way. So the question now is, do I dock under here? Oh my, Evelyn, what have you been doing? She's vomiting. Do we really want to touch this? Damn. I'll have to reset. How's it going? She's vomiting. Far more in excess of her body mass. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> We're going to be seeing a lot more of her ugly friends if this keeps up. <laughs> All right. We need to find her and fast. This is getting out of hand. Agreed. You know, if you're going to create something like this, you should really create some... Method of containment or neutralization. Like if it's a, a virus that's causing some kind of mutation, you should develop a way to, to counteract that virus and its mutation, ideally, before you start an experiment like this. Because if she ever gets out, you're going to need to neutralize her. And it's pretty obvious you can't just rely on shooting her. Well, someone ate part of their meal before shit hit the fan. Can we close the door, please? I'm assuming we need to head for the elevator, but you never know. Oh, crap. Well, you went down easy enough. Oh. Okay. Still can't go through there. We are getting farther away. I wonder where that goes. Okay, we're still getting farther away, so she must be on a different level. Well, we can try climbing up and see what happens. Nothing useful. Got it. There's still this room, which we cannot get in at the moment. Is there a way of dealing with this goop? Or is that way just going to be blocked the entire time? <clears throat> He's okay in here, right? Yeah, he hasn't died yet. Is he going to end up... Oh, was that Evelyn? Yep, okay. Come back, Evelyn. Wonder how long I'm gonna have to wait for the elevator. Oh, here we go. It wasn't too bad. Funny, as I look up at the open vent, a friend pops out to say hi. Don't you close on me. So we've got a fuse in here for whatever good it's going to do us. So are we on S2 or are we on 2? We're on 2F. 2F. What the hell good does that do us? Hey, no, don't, don't do that again. Wow. Like, 
pop up an invisible wall so you can't walk through while it's opening and closing. All right, well, I'm going to go to three. Not responding. No. Oh, so two S is the only one available. Got it. Do we need more fuses or something? That is an excellent question. But we're closer to her. Got a hard hat. I wonder if we still can't put that on. Well, we'll see. Yeah, no hard hat for us. She's making a mess of this ship, though, isn't she? So how many years ago did this happen? I mean, honestly, I don't remember this gun ever being standard for any military in an English-speaking country. Is it dead? Its head didn't explode. It's getting a little dark, isn't it? Fortunately, it's actually brighter in the video I'm recording. I've got contrast and brightness, or contrast and gamma filters on it, because once it's uploaded to YouTube, it gets even darker. Good, good, some ammo. Gonna need more of that. Oh, jeez, I, I need some chem fluid. Lots and lots of chem fluid. I don't know, maybe if I was using the psychostimulants, I'd be finding chem fluid. Then I'd be able to make everything I want to make. Hello, sir. Oh, this isn't like a Call of Duty game where aim doesn't get, uh... Wow. Hit your mist. That was unfortunate. Get to do a little ham with the ammo there. We're getting closer, okay. It's gonna say at 40 something, we're farther away. I wanna check this box at the end of the hall. Yeah, I think she's in there. Remote bomb. Okay, those may come in handy. Okay, can we go in there? You know, I'm out of shape. I sit at a computer all day long. I can run faster than the people in this game can. Where's he going? Down here? There we go. This thing is more unstable than it would be in real life. It's just video game developers not understanding how guns work. But then again, when most of them have what they've seen in movies as their basis for their understanding of firearms, it's not really a surprise. When you fire a gun like this semi-auto, it really only throws you off for a fraction of a second if you're trained, you know, to handle it. If, if you're not trained to handle it, then yeah, it would probably throw you off for more than that. But for someone who uses guns like this on a regular basis, goes to shooting ranges, etc., practices, it's not going to throw you off that badly. You're going to be able to continuously fire with reasonable accuracy in semi-auto. To go out on a limb and assume I should go this way first. Uh, yeah, I've got a knife, that's right. Ah, chem fluid. Just what we needed. Oh no, this can't end well. Her voice sounds familiar. Is it the same voice actress who did Claire? I should say who did the voice of Claire, because I know that previous statement could easily just be misinterpreted. You know, it's the internet. People say crazy stuff. Oh, 
Can't use that. Maybe I can use this. Oh boy. Well, I'm through the door at least. Don't imagine that lock is ever going to work again. What kind of corrosive is that? Are you mad at me, Mommy? No, Evie. I I'm not mad. Wait. What did you call me? I don't want to live at the lab anymore. I want a house. And I want you to be my mommy. Okay, Evie. I I'll be your mommy. Just, just come back with me. Right now. Okay? All right. It's going up and down as we move. So either she's mobile or she's on another level. Where are you, Evie? She must be below us. Because I don't think she can be above us. Oh, there she is. Hello, Evie. <laughs> Evie, wait! Did you find her? Yes, but she ran off. She's making more friends, Alan. Those things are everywhere. I told you so. <coughs> are you okay? You just worry about getting Evelyn back. Come on. Doors. There we go. Kill either of them. I'm gonna run out of ammo. I didn't have a chance to heal. I noticed earlier that some of them were healing, even after headshots, if you keep shooting them. It does not seem to be the case at the moment. I picked up any psychostimulants? No. I did pick up corrosives, though, and there were safes I could not open earlier. Sadly, I do not see a way up there. At least not from here. I don't see one over there, either. Of course, I don't think there's anything to grab up there. I can open this door now. What the? What she smack the door for? Oh, good, more corrosive. Nice. Corrosive bombs and ammo. Could definitely use that. So I think I'm at the point where I've got so many bombs that I might as well start using them. I've only got four. That's right, I only picked up two earlier. Okay. Interesting smoke. Wonder what she's up to. Oh, never mind. I think I have figured it out. Now I'm not gonna waste the bombs. Oh, looks like he lost his head. That one worked out better than the last one. It was point blank. This thing has a pretty slow rate of fire, doesn't it? Not much of a submachine gun, especially for the amount of recoil. All right, she's on level one. Two, three. She stopped on three. Was there one of these on the last? Uh, never mind. Never mind. All right, level three. We cannot go back to level two. Interesting. Very interesting. Emergency safety lockdown system has been engaged. Uh-oh. 
Okay, well, it's been 25 minutes, so I'm going to call this here. So thanks for watching, everyone, and have a nice day.